Hey there, in this lesson I'm going to show you how to restore a database to SQL Server. I've expanded the databases node. I'm going to right click on that and I'm going to select restore. This brings me up this window here. I'm going to drop down here and browse to my file. Select add. Now I've saved the AdventureWorks 2017.back file to the root of C. So I'm going to highlight that, select OK. This up here is showing me the path to my file, and this is showing me what, what it's going to be called. So if I wanted, I can change that to my database if I wanted. I can change that to whatever I want, select OK, and it will restore successfully. So let's remove that a second, right click and delete that. And let's restore that again, but with the correct name this time. Browse to my root on a C drive, grab AdventureWorks 2017. I'm going to keep the same name this time. Select OK. And here I have I've restored AdventureWorks 2017. Alternatively, if I wanted to retain this, I can right click on it, restore, browse to my file again, select add, select AdventureWorks 2017, select OK, and within the options, I can overwrite the existing one, so that will replace it for me. Select OK, and that will overwrite over the top of that. And I want to show you a really handy feature which I strongly suggest you take a look at. If I went to this. So I'm going to restore AdventureWorks 2017. And what SQL provides is a scripting option. So I can script that to a new query window. Cancel that. And what this does is this shows you the code that's needed to restore. So here's all the code that's needed if I wanted to restore AdventureWorks 2017. I'll show you that works because I could remove AdventureWorks, close any existing connections. I can just run that in and that will restore successfully. Refresh and there it is. So with this code here, the reason I wanted to show you this is in reality you probably still will use the window. It's quick, it's easy, but it's still very advisable you understand how to restore from code because there will be times in your career when you will need to just restore quickly and it's just sometimes it's easier and quicker just to open a new window and restore from a query. Any questions? Let me know.